the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. When our backs were against the wall, and it looked as if it was over, you made a way and we're standing here only because you made and we're rising here only because you move mountains you cause walls to fall you perform miracles And there is nothing That's impossible So we stand in here Only because you You made a way Listen, South Africa, believe me, this mystery will open you doors. Some of you, tomorrow, you will not go to work just with your file. You will carry a bottle of wine and knock on the office of your CEO and says, why are you here? You say, sir, just, just spare me a minute. I just want to thank you for giving me a job. I have discerned the wisdom. I went to church on Sunday and I was taught that honor is the discerning, the celebrating and the rewarding of uniqueness. You are a blessed man. I have seen you close deals and this is a token of my honor for you. You do that, I guarantee you, it will not take one month. You will fly as though you were in a lift. Listen, something interesting happened. I, I was having a domestic flight to Lagos, then to connect to come. And while I was in that flight, the, the cabin crew, you know, the, the, the hostess, she looked at me and said, ah, Apostle, I mean, I'm the one serving you. And then she was happy. And while she served, she told the pilot that Apostle was in the plane. And then, you know, in the air, he now decided to embarrass me. And you know, just just made that public. I was just trying to hide, and I'm then he now just I said, ah, you know, shout out to this, 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 and oh, I said, oh God, no, don't do this to me now. And then while he did that, I began to rejoice myself because I said, this man will never be the same. Now, truly, I may not have to see him. Honor is powerful. It works like a charm. This is my final session and then I leave. But I do not want to leave you the way you are. Now listen, this is what I want you to do. In the next 10 minutes, watch this. You are going to, aside from the pastor, you are going to walk around this entire place and look for someone and just appreciate him. I don't know who you are and what you carry, but I love and I celebrate that grace. In doing this, many of you will be receiving impartations that you, you don't have to fall down. God 
bless you. May God, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. And while that is happening, as you are mixing a grace your destiny needs that is at the back, you just hug that grace into your life. Shake that grace into your life. Are you ready to do this? With understanding and prophetically. Rise up, walk around. Meet someone. You don't have to know the person. Celebrate the person. No, don't come to me. Don't come to me and don't come to Pastor and his wife. You made a way. And what you represent I tap into your open doors I tap into the grace upon your life minute and you are back to your seat you are celebrating someone for the investment of God's grace upon their lives no jealousy no fighting no competition I tap into that grace with understanding We're about to pray. Hallelujah. Please return to your seat. Return to your seat. It's time to pray. Your life is about to change. Believe me. Turn to your seat. We're about to pray. That song you sang, there is a part of it that I want him to sing again. Your new album, your song. And whilst you sing that song, the moment you're done, I'm going to pray. This is my last session. Please be patient. Someone's life is changing. People are, people are crying all over this place. Don't be ashamed of your tears. It's a new season. These are the laws of the kingdom. Hallelujah. Now, listen, I don't know why God allowed both of you to come out, but you will never be the same. Never be the same. I speak over your life. I speak over your life. In the name of Jesus, I speak over your life. I speak over your life. In the name of Jesus, you will never be the same. You step into a new season. I open new doors for you. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Go ahead. Now you join him to sing this song just for two to five minutes. South Africa, lift your voice and celebrate victory.
Now, listen. I want to pray for the sick now before the final impartation. You're sick in your body. You're trusting God for a miracle. Please lay your hands there. Lay your hands right now. The anointing of the Spirit is mighty in this place. Please lay your hands there. If it's a part of your body you cannot touch, just place your hand on your chest. Please. Let's, let's minimize movements so that I can minister to you. The power of God is about to touch you now. Now listen, this is what will happen. We'll be very fast. We have just maybe five minutes for this. As soon as I pray for you, many of you are already getting healed. The power of God is going to touch you right there. And the moment, I'm going to give you an opportunity to check yourself. And the moment you find out that a miracle has happened, I want you to run out maybe here or here wherever. And then please let me have one or two officials they will just check on you and then we'll have a few testimonies we have to announce to principalities and powers here at excel 2020 that jesus the christ of god is still lord hallelujah something is happening i want to pray now in the name of jesus christ my god such a strong anointing the symbol for me just the symbol for me right now every devil of infirmity ah, such an anointing here every devil of infirmity by the power of the Holy Ghost I command come out of everyone that is sick now in the name of Jesus come on South Africa in the name of Jesus Right now I declare by the power of the Holy Ghost the healing anointing is touching you now be healed in the name of Jesus be healed in the name of Jesus my God my God from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet be healed right now the Lord is healing an abdominal condition this is what I'm seeing the power of the Holy Ghost someone having an abdominal it looks like a growth or something it disappears right now in the name of Jesus there's someone you have a pain along please help them the power of God is touching them um, there's a pain along your, your limb here the anointing of the Spirit is touching you right now in the name of Jesus pain around your 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 shoulder the power of God is touching you right now touching you right now touching you right now touching you right now someone you don't hear well the power of God is touching you now I command that deaf ear to open in the name of Jesus if you are here on your own crutches lift that crutch now lift that crutch now in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ there's there's someone hold on please I'm seeing I'm seeing um, like a lump just a lump around a, a breast lump right now it dissolves in the name of Jesus Christ um, I'm seeing someone with a condition around your throat this you continue to cough out sputum indefinitely the Lord is touching you right now wherever you are in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ Harusia Salakaduziada heaviness heaviness around your body in the name of Jesus be healed right now be healed right now I'm seeing someone you are so weak you can't stand for long the moment you begin to feel dizzy you begin to feel nauseated in the name of Jesus the power of the Holy Ghost is is touching you there's someone you don't it's like you don't smell or I don't know something affected your smelling let it be restored right now my God the power of God is touching people here in the name of Jesus now whether I mention your case or not following online and here in this building be healed in the name of Jesus 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 eye conditions be healed blood conditions be healed in the mighty name of Jesus now Colin is going to raise this song again please don't go back we're still singing this will be our anthem for today please come come quickly come as he's raising this song I want you to check yourself you will find out a miracle has happened to you right now i like you to run out come stand here let's disgrace the devil in south africa with this holy convocation check yourself check yourself right now and come out 
my God miracles are happening are you seeing check yourself the moment the power of God touches you there's a miracle please make your way to the front right now miracles are happening please celebrate them as they come celebrate them as they come celebrate them as they come check yourself check yourself happening in this place check yourself check yourself mighty miracles South Africa is this how you celebrate miracles my God my God now listen let's let's hear what happened to you okay the mic is there quickly what happened to you my dear aha I had a stomach cramps. okay what did you say stomach cramps. stomach cramps in the name of Jesus Christ I stretch my hands to you it never returns again by the power of the Holy Spirit amen and amen celebrate Jesus yes please Come again, darling. I had migraines. Migraines. And now, I feel better. completely, come, come. In the name of Jesus, come, darling. It never returns to you again by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus Christ. I was feeling pain in the left side. From is, is the mic working? Feeling pain on the side from the From side here. To For how long, my dear? For a long time. And now, check time. yourself. Run. Check. Any pain? Any pain look what is God is doing here that song Next person, very quickly. What's your name and the testimony? My name is Livisa. I've been suffering from bed pains for a while. My God. How long? 2018. What happened now? I just felt like a fire is coming down my spine. And right now? Yes. yes completely. Bend down. Check yourself. Check yourself. Any pain? Any pain? My God. Jump. Any pain? Hallelujah. Any pain? Any pain? Hallelujah. The anointing of the Holy Ghost is on her. In the name of Jesus Christ. Look, miracles are happening in this place. People are checking themselves. Some of you will need to um, just go to the convenience to check yourself. Others will need to go to the hospital. And in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare, you are healed now, healed forever. Yes, please. Apostle, look what God is doing. Yes, go ahead. I, I, had, I had a problem with my left ear. Your left ear? For how long? Years. How long? Just, just give us um, at least I was 20, something years. twenty something years. And now, and now it's I'm open. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Okay. Yesterday, uh, when the apostle was saying, receive your grace, I saw light coming out of his hand. 
and then I, for five months, uh, my leg was broken doing gymnastics. Your legs was broken. So I was using a crutches and plaster. Yes. So, uh, uh, early this morning, I took off the plaster, and I am healed. Jesus, come, come on, come on. Look at this. 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 Listen, listen, listen. Miracles are real. Find a way of believing it. Not, not, not everyone is playing games and doing a lot of nonsense. No, 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 no. The power of God is very real. Look, this brother, your leg was broken five years ago. Five months ago, it was broken. I went to the hospital. They find the bones were still broken. So yesterday, as he was ministering and saying, receive the grace, I saw white light coming out of his hand, and I said, I am healed. My God. <laughs> Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Hallelujah. Now, please listen. For three weeks, I've been having my voice gone. Your voice gone? Oh, she's crying. So, so, yeah, my voice is back. I'm just sitting down. Shout Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. The voice is back. Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You are free now and free forever by the power of the Holy Ghost. Give Jesus praise. the name of Jesus it never returns to you by the power of the Holy Ghost I, I want to know what happened to mama yes what happened to you my name is Zayel Zikere I suffer from the Lord long time okay and I believe since I entered this premises what what could what you not do my leg was so, so, oh your leg was yes, swollen yes. okay now I'm better since I entered this premises. Once upon a time, I, I dreamed pastor went into my house and annoyed my house. I was so happy. <laughs> Mama, come. Hold my hands. I bring you life Amen. now. Amen. In the name of Jesus, help her. Life. Give Jesus praise. Look what God is doing in this place. Yes, please. Amen. My name is Mfara Malebe. I've been having severe pains on at my shoulder since 2017. And always when it's time to worship in church, I can't stand. I have to sit down. But right now, I couldn't lift my shoulder. Check yourself. Hallelujah. Look at this. Look at this. Yes, please. My name is Mary. I was diagnosed with osteoarthritis 2017. So I osteoarthritis. Okay. You couldn't move this right shoulder. So when we are praying, I just feel something like move it now. Hey, look at this. Hallelujah. Look at this. Hallelujah. Diagnosed of arthritis. Come. By the power of the Holy Ghost. You are a man of God here. May you carry this grace back to your assembly. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the living God. Come, my dear. In the name of Jesus, never returns to you again by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, please. My God. Amen. Yes. Okay. Um, when I woke up this morning and something I spoke to oncologists about. Okay. Because when I cough, I have this flame that come out. Okay. So the whole morning I've been sitting there and it's been coming and it's been coming because she says it's from the tumor. But as I was coughing, the flame was starting to come out. It's strong. Hallelujah.
When I saw the meaning of this song, that's why I asked you to sing it again. It's a very powerful song. The part you sing before this and this are two parts you will keep singing till I leave South Africa. I hope you don't mind. My God. Miracles are a proof of the love of God. Look at people crying. Look at people crying all over. Look at people crying. The, the power of the Holy Ghost. Woman of God, in the name of Jesus, I have vowed and I told you that I agree with you. I stand by the anointing of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, never returns. Yes, please. Please sit for a few minutes. I apologize keeping you standing. Just a few minutes and we're done for this service. But it, th there is a final impartation I do not want you to miss. Please. Whatever price you will play, just a word upon your life and you will go back a sign and a wonder. Go ahead, please, quickly, quickly. Um, Apostle, my name is Lucy Lee. For the past two weeks, I've been having a massive pain when I breathe, especially. Yes. It even affected my studies. Even now, as she was saying, this hold, I felt so much pain. But now, I don't feel it. I can breathe. Breathe in. Even breathe in and out. Go ahead. Breathe in and out. Look at this. Breathe in and out. In the name of Jesus, it never returns to you again by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, please. Please help the woman of God. Yes, go ahead. Uh, greetings. My name is Bakumo Khutu from IDK. My left knee was having pain for the past years, two years, three years. Okay. Now I'm healed and also my shoulders. Your shoulder? Yes. Completely. Check yourself. Go ahead. Check yourself. Any pain? It never returns to you again by the power of the Holy Ghost. Okay. And I believe by this grace that the member in our church was blind. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. Yes. Good morning. Uh, my name is Nosim Boba. For the past five months, I've been having daily constant excruciating pains. Okay. The heart. Okay. And at some stage, my husband took me to the hospital and they took me to for x-rays, but they couldn't find anything. Okay. But daily, I could not even breathe, like take a, like a, a deep breath. Yes. But after you prayed, I tested it. I breathed. Breathe in and out. Go ahead. In and out. Any pain? In and out, any pain. South Africa, celebrate Jesus. It never returns to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, please. Quickly. My name is Wulanel Koto. Apostle, I've been waiting for you since I heard you were coming. Wow. I have a chest problem. So I use, this is what I use most of the time. Let's see. Oh, the inhaler now? Yes, the inhaler. Okay. So when you said we should put our hands on where it's with you. Yes. I put my hand on my chest and I felt like I was putting on a sponge and I am fine now. Breathe in and out, darling. I stretch my hands towards you. May the anointing of the Holy Ghost touch you now. Now! An end comes to this forever in Jesus' name. I'm seeing him on a cross. What happened to you, sir? My name is Paul Soto. I had a stroke in December. Stroke? Yes, when I came. My God, you can see all of the... Yes. You couldn't raise your left hand. Listen, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for you. By the power of the Holy Ghost, the Lord will perfect you. Stroke is a spirit. We curse you and I release you. Now, now, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ. Sir, look at me. Move your legs. Move your legs gradually 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 look at the miracle happening in the name of jesus hold my hand the lord perfects you in jesus name in jesus name i pray please hold him keep him god bless you yes please very quickly my name is Nduma. yes i had a sudden lymph node it was so painful you had a lymph node yeah, that was swollen. I even tell okay i took my last antibiotic last night yes It's gone completely. In the name of Jesus Christ, never returns to you. Quickly. My name is Tando. I've had my back ache for 25 years. 25 years. But my surprise this morning, the whole time I've been on my feet, I couldn't stand for five minutes. You couldn't stand for five minutes before. Mama, walk. Go. Any pain. Any pain. Completely. Come on, South Africa. Give Jesus praise. 
give Jesus praise any pain no pain in the name of Jesus it never returns to you by the anointing of the Holy Ghost yes please You don't smell. I don't know how many things smells like. You don't know how things smell like. Oh, what's so bad is that I'm in the business of manufacturing fragrances. Oh, you're in the business of fragrances and you don't smell. Yes. Oh, I always have to rely on my husband to tell me how they smell like. Is your husband here? No. Okay. And what happened now? I don't know how anything smells like. I don't know. Can, can you imagine that? Come. In the name of Jesus Christ. How can you be in the business of fragrance and then you don't smell anything? Look, look, can you see the power of the Holy Ghost on her? Look at this. Look at this. I, I've not even prayed for her. Look at, look at what is happening to her. That devil. Now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go now. Pick up. Go, go and check out later on. Yes, go ahead. Okay. Thank you so much, Apostle. My name is John. Uh, Apostle, I had, uh, I've been having a problem for 13 years with pornography. And oh the Holy Spirit has asked me to open a foundation to help other Christians and other people. Who Go are and look for your for perfume it. or fragrance. Okay, he told you to open a foundation. Yes, sir. Wow. Um, let me first pray for you. See, come, this, these things are spirit. It's not enough to want to be free. You have to be set free. Right? You believe that? Hold my hands. Shout Jesus as loud as you can. Jesus! Out of him now. Otherwise, he will go back to it again. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now, I release the grace to set up the organization. I empower you right now. I call for destiny helpers from all over South Africa. In the name of Jesus Christ. It's gone. Yes, please. Go ahead. The power of God is on her, precious lady. Whatever it is, uh, we may not be able to take her testimony, but in Jesus' name, I stretch my hands. Help her. Stretch my hands towards her. Go ahead. Apostle, my son, for over six years, he has been having um, sinuses problems. Sinuses? Yes, he has become my alarm. Like every time, four o'clock until seven, and even before we go to sleep. Yes. But last night, I put it as a, as a prayer request, and then he slept. Nothing in the morning. Nothing happened from the prayer request yesterday night. Jesus. Hold on, please. It moved to the young one. He was the oh, one it moved one. to the young one too. Yes. Both of them. And you dropped it as a request yesterday. Yes. He was delivered last night and then now i heard the sound in, um, on him in the morning yes no 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 it, it will never not in this place yes. <laughs> god is called alpha omega come let me lay my hands on them come my dear what do you want to become you want to become what a pilot pilot ah, you want to fly me amazing in the name of jesus sinuses you are a devil that i cost now you go now and go forever in the name of Jesus and the grace to become the pilot that you desire release upon you and come you who is the mother grace upon you go and excel in the name of Jesus yes please go ahead uh, good morning uh, my name is teacher Sani. Um, uh, there are so many other miracles happening we we'll have to stop somewhere so that otherwise we're going to spend the whole day here uh, so we can do the impartation but that, that's all right maybe the last the last set yeah okay. go ahead on 2014 i had to drop out of school i had migraines i had a lot of problems so i dropped out then the next year by the grace of god i went back i still had the same problems depressions and all that i felt like killing myself but i continued to pray and trusted the lord that he shall heal, heal me and then i started listening to your teachings hmm. i think around june that's when i got to the understanding of who god is and how god applies his ways and then I was, I believe that I was healed of that. And then currently I have this problem where my legs are cold. I feel cold in my legs mm. and my body shivers. Come. Right? Hold my hands. Hold my hands with both of your hands. In the name of Jesus, I bring you life. You see, we represent a kingdom that is truly superior. And we bring you the realities of that kingdom. I speak to you, the grace, something is living you well. Huh? In the name of Jesus, go and excel. By the power of the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. Yes. What happened? No, him first. He wanted to speak. He was healed. Well, let him speak. He can speak. Hi, how are you? My name is Akani. Oh dear. Oh dear. Since 
it's from in the morning I went to school. My tummy was sore, so I couldn't even eat in the morning. So, so once my um last night my mom prayed for me, then my tummy was feeling better. Completely. Place your hand on your tummy. Place one hand on your tummy. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you for this, our adorable angel. We declare you are perfected now by the power of the Holy Spirit. You're the mom? No, I don't even know him. You don't even know him? <laughs> mom? mom? Where, where is she? Come. Come and receive something that will change your life. I listen to your teachings. I sleep with your teachings. And ever since then, my prayer life has been revived. My left ear has been opened because there was a spirit that blew on my ear. And now I keep on having the sensations. Thank you so much, sir, for your obedience. God bless you. In the name of Jesus, the power of the Holy Ghost on you. You will never be the same. In the name of Jesus, I bless you. And for this lovely lady, you don't know the boy and yet you brought him favor. Receive that grace now. In the name of Jesus. Go ahead, please. Quickly, quickly. Apostle, I felt my, my case is very minute, but I have to give God the praise and honor for okay. it. Okay. I've been having an ENT uh, problem. ENT, okay. Yeah. How long? Um, it's been for five to six years. Okay. And I keep on coughing and spitting a hard piece of mucus. Okay. But when the mucus form, I have to keep on clearing my throat like mm -hmm. every time. Mm -hmm. And that has been affecting my self-confidence hmm. and and what happened to you now i can feel that it's clear i don't have to clear my throat place my your throat hand is... there you've never seen a miracle in your life watch one now hold my hands in the name of jesus christ the power of the holy ghost right now over now celebrate jesus go ahead amen Long. I've got a side pain and by, by my the pain by your side? By my side. Okay. Home, uh -huh. At the start of this conference on Wednesday, th Thursday morning, I have a discharge, but I didn't know what's going on. And today. Please begin to play the keyboard for me. I just saw a vision and I saw the power of God already touching people. You don't have to bring them out now. And that impartation is going to start. Um, I'm about to pray, but we're almost rounding up. I just saw. You don't have to bring them out. I saw. The spirit of the Lord, just just like a wind, from the left to the right, row by row, just touching people. You are not all receiving the same thing. God is just visiting you according to your need. So that it's going to start now, right from the front to the back, while we are taking the testimony. So don't be surprised when you find out that the power of the Holy Ghost now begins to come upon you strong. Go ahead. I was saying I was having a side pain problem. Yes, and now what what happened to you? And by the starting of this conference on Thursday morning, I have a discharge that I didn't know what's going on. I just said that maybe it's just nothing. I started to have more and more pains, more and more pains. But when you're praying and say, touch whatever you're feeling, I feel nothing to Completely. Nothing to Come. Bless the name of the Lord. It never returns to you by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, please. My name is Wangina Makoba. I suffered from severe inflammation. Is the mic light is loud enough? Yes. Go ahead. I suffered from severe inflammation for the past two years. Okay. Which has caused the joint pains. Joint pains and all of that. My chest, my thyroid, mm -hmm. and the itchiness. What happened now? As we were praying, my body started to Look, shake. The power of the Holy Ghost is on her. Look at me. Yes. Look at me. And I bring you life now. Now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Be set free. Be healed forever forever you know the bible says now the lord is that spirit he says and where the spirit of the lord is there is liberty go ahead my name is Tumi Nakani. i had severe pipes as you were praying i went out to the ladies they disappeared completely in the name of jesus be healed now now out of her life forever Diabetes. Yes. Okay. And also have bone problems, joint problems, and also the issue of the 
throat. Oh, I see. What what happened to you now? Now, as I, you were saying, we must yes. take our bodies where it's painful. Mm. I feel the, the, the like a relief. My, my, my chest was relieved. Okay. And also, I was also diagnosed with depression. Depression. So I had to leave work. It shows. I've, I've not been working for two years. Just place your hand on your chest. You believe in Jesus? Hold my hands. Just leave the mic. Hold my hands. I'm also watching your services. I'm watching, I'm watching all of them. I've downloaded all of them. I pray in my bedroom. I cry. Out! Now! Out of her! Depression is a spirit. It's not just a phenomenon. It's a spirit. Madam, be free now. It takes more than counseling. It's a spirit. There's one other person that this same spirit is living now. I just saw it in a vision. Right? The power of God is coming on that person now. As I'm talking right now. I just saw light. That, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a spirit of depression. Where is that person? Right now, I'm praying. The power of God is coming on that person supernaturally. Out! Now! Go ahead. Let's, let's finish up. My name is Peter Lissapo. Uh, my testimonies of the miracle just took place right now at home. When you entered, I told my mom she was having a, a problem of diarrhea for many days and she could not eat f and food remain. But yes. when you entered, I told you here. So now after, then I just phoned her now. I said, how do you feel? She said, I have eaten and nothing has ever Amen. happened again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come. Hold my hands. I pray for you and I pray for her. Perfection. In the name of Jesus. Yes, please. Who's the next person? Very quickly, we have to wrap up. Yeah. Thank you, Apostle. My pleasure. To meet you. Uh, I've encountered you last year, so at night. So today when you said we must uh, hold uh, places of uh, issues, yes. I touch my sinuses and immediately... Sinuses? Uh, sinuses. Yeah. I started, as we started to pray, they began to drain. Yes. And now I am breathing from both of them. Wow. Wow. I, I, I'd like you to take the opportunity to really thank you for what you've done in my life since meeting. Amen. 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 God bless you. God bless you. Come. I pray for you. Hold my hands. In the name of Jesus, may the life of God and the power of God perfect you and may you go from glory to glory. In Jesus' name I pray. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. She couldn't speak for herself. She's my wife, so I just want to share the devil. Okay. When we came here, she couldn't see from far distance. She could only see when something is close. She couldn't read from the projections. My God. But now she could see. Clearly, she can see now. Yes, she can read. She was reading. She can read everything. Yes. Oh, she's, oh, the power of God. Yes, the anointing. And it's coming on you too, you know. Right now, you are a husband. It's coming on you too. Step into that grace. It's not only your wife. Receive that grace. Speed to your life. Speed to your destiny. In the name of Jesus, this family will never be the same. Never be the same from today. Yes, go ahead. Greetings, my name. Go ahead, go ahead. Greetings, my name is Siwela. I just want to take one second to thank God for the opportunity of having you here. Amen. Don't cry, darling. Don't cry. Six surgeries. What for? For endometriosis. In the last surgery, my gynae told me that I have to freeze my eggs. Because my ovarian comes. He said you have to freeze your eggs. And oh. I said I can't. I can't. Since I was 12, I've had endometriosis. And they've been telling me that I must have a child. And I said I cannot transgress the word of God and have a child out of the <laughs> I now have a look inside of me, but I don't have pain. Any pain right now? No pain. Come. Come. You believe in miracles? I'm praying for you in the open, in the presence of everybody. So that when the miracle that happens to you, your, your gynae will marvel and wonder. If they ask you, bring them to church. Now, place one hand on your tummy and hold my hands.
father for your glory a correction now now it's over forever yes go ahead I love you too. I love you so much. God bless you. I, I, had, a, I had a problem on my neck starting from that I started yesterday. So it was when we were praying, it became okay, but it wasn't affected. So I knew that if I come here and a person touches me, not only will I be. Lay your hand there. What do you do? I'm, I'm working for ESCO to produce electricity. You are going to have a business of your own. It will start in the month of June. I release that grace upon you right now you will become a multi-millionaire i'm seeing i'm releasing that grace upon you in the name of jesus christ and then be perfected right now but that grace for entrepreneurship i release it upon you you will start your business it you will marvel and wonder at what the anointing will do upon your business amen go ahead apostle i always wanted to come to nigeria for you Amen. God brought you to South Africa. Thank you. Hallelujah. I thank the Lord for using Apostle Oko. Yes. For this grace. Amen. Thank you. I've had two major operations for fibroids. For fibroids? Yes. Last month I was told again that it's back again. I don't want another operation. I want to have a baby. You want to be healed? You want a baby? Yes. Oh, you don't have a baby? No. Oh, no, then that, that's... No, 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 we'll settle that right now, 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 now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dear. You have to sing that song. You have to sing that song. Go ahead. I want you to hear this song while you are sleeping. I want the whole of South Africa to hear and sing this song. There's, there's an anointing on this song for South Africa, believe me. Five words operated twice is regrown again and she's trusting God for a child ah. son of man he said can these bones live again my dear look at me we represent a government that is truly superior and these are not cunningly devised fables lay your own hand on your stomach now in the name of Jesus Christ by the power that raised Christ from the dead I command fibroid you die and leave this body now now in the mighty name of jesus christ be gone now and be gone forever and i speak to you according to the time of life return with your child and your children in the name of jesus i declare that this fiber will disappear it will pass out of your body in the mighty name of jesus christ you are free now and you are free forever in jesus name amen receive your miracle god bless you good day uh, the reason i'm standing here it's not for me it's amen. for my mom your mom okay my mom had leg ulcers but now she's not here but my request is that her leg okay they've healed but now the what, what's wrong with her she's got leg ulcers oh i see but now they've healed the problem is that because her leg she hasn't been walking for quite a while okay her leg needs to be straightened out i've asked her to come with me and she no problem you come Jesus. you can stand in faith for her you believe that hold my hands excel 2020 be healed i bring you life be healed please all stand around you know hallelujah
listen what is upon us is what controls what is around us you have tabernacled for days many of you have traveled from far you have made sacrifices it's time to receive Just sing that song softly for me one more time. I want to pray and release something upon your life. The other part of the song. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God, I declare right now the grace that makes things work. My God, I'm seeing fire all over. The grace is called the grace for performance. Baris ko litalia aparuza kata. At the count of three, from my left to my right, the front to the back. Blessed is she that believes, the Bible says, for unto her there shall be a performance. Take that grace. One, two, three. Take that grace now. Take that grace now. Accomplish help, help, first lady. Take that grace. Things you couldn't do, I release that grace. House of Treasures, South Africa. I impart that grace. Hallelujah. I impart that grace. I impart that grace. Hallelujah. I impart that grace. I impart that grace. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Listen to me. There is a grace for influence. Because thou hast loved righteousness and hated wickedness. The Bible says, therefore God, even thy God, have anointed you with the oil of gladness that sets you above your fellows i pray for someone here in the name of jesus the grace that distinguishes you from the crowd take that grace now take that grace now take that, grace now. Take that anointing now help them please help them please take that anointing be distinguished i place grace upon you a mark of excellence a mark of excellence be distinguished he said there is a spirit in man anywho and the breath of the almighty I want to release the spirit of revelation on someone access illumination to the depth of scripture at the count of three in no small way let it rest one two three Hallelujah. step into that grace illumination revelation light step into that dimension I open up scripture I open up scripture in the name of Jesus here lift your hands it's time for your business to step into a dimension please believe me the Bible says believe the Lord your God so shall you be established he said believe his prophets you are in business lift your hands I don't care what is happening or not happening believe I want to release grace upon your business in the name of Jesus I open the two lift gates of South Africa Johannesburg over your business step into a realm of strange exploits step into a realm of strange exploits 
I bless your products and your services. I give them wings. They go beyond the borders of this city. They go beyond the borders of this city. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Please place your hand down. I want to pray for you. Listen. The Bible says, we're wrapping up. It says, Hagar was crying because she was in a desert land and there was no water and then the young lad ishmael was also crying and then the bible says the lord heard the voice of the young lad and the moment he spoke with hagar she looked and saw an oasis of water that means until god opens your eyes the answer is there but you may not see i pray for you wherever your answer is hiding in the name of jesus excel 2020 i open your eyes to see i open your eyes to see where your solutions are i hope help them please i open your eyes to see in the mighty name of jesus hallelujah excellence is a spirit it's not just a culture there is a spirit of excellence it says oh lord my god how excellent is your name your name is not just great it excels excellence is like the rising of the sun you never have a better yesterday when that spirit is upon you i pray for you your 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 apostle is an excellent man and i stand in agreement with the grace that is upon his life house of treasures south africa Take the grace for excellence. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And finally, let me call your destiny helpers into your life. Listen, no destiny helper comes on their own. They are called by prophecy. These are the ordinances of the kingdom. They can pass you every day and yet not attend to you. Was it not the bones were all there in the valley but they could not come together but they were there just because you could not see them and if those bones are your client you may remain Hallelujah. there it took prophecy and bones began to be joined to bones yes. just because you don't see it does not mean it's not around i prophesy to the north of south africa to the south of south africa the east of south africa the west of south africa everybody who must show up in your destiny your business your church to hold your hands and lift you I command their ministry over your life in the name of Jesus receive the ministry of destiny help us in the mighty name of Jesus hear me destiny help us are men ordained anointed and commissioned to lift your hands they will lift you with no strings attached one more time i call them into your hands call them into your life in the name of jesus christ for everyone who attended this excel conference in the name of jesus by this time next year return 10 times better spiritually 10 times better financially 10 times better Praise the name of the Lord. We're wrapping up. Give me five minutes and we're done. Two things we're going to do here. I'm, I've, I've been given the permission to receive um, an offering. The normal offering. Your normal offering. Okay, so package it quickly. I just want to pray and bless it. And then I want to make an altar call very quickly. Listen, this we're wrapping up. The Bible says, if... <clears throat> listen, it says... Ye must be born again 
it was not a suggestion good master what must I do to inherit eternal life the apostles they came and they said they were caught to the heart the people said on the day of Pentecost and he said men and brethren what shall we do and say repent for the remission of your sins and you shall receive this promise for the promise is unto you and to your children and children's children as many as are far off even to those that the Lord will call you are seated here you are following online and you are saying apostle before you leave South Africa it will be my joy to completely receive the life of God to end my life and begin his life in me and you are here you are saying I, I've given my life to Christ but for some reason things just went haywire and I really truly want to make it right with God we have just one minute wherever you are leave your seat and run like there's fire on the mountain come stand in front here I want to pray for you I'm only going to count three or four and then you come don't wait for someone to be the first one let's celebrate them as they come South Africa let's honor salvation run don't be ashamed there's nothing to be ashamed of apostle I want to come but I'm ashamed I'm afraid of my friends leave them and come quickly I think I'm born again but I'm not sure join them there's no such thing as not being sure there's something called the assurance of salvation join them join them thank you mama thank you all of you who are coming some of you are crying don't be ashamed of your tears this is why he put forth this meeting listen let me tell you no matter you see the house of God is like a hospital yes you come as you are but you don't stay as you are you come as you are and then you are changed hallelujah I salute every one of you for coming I love you from the depth of my heart thank you thank you for making that sacrifice now please lift your right hand and say this after me say it passionately say it truthfully you're not reciting a poem Jesus is here say Lord Jesus I believe in you that you are the Son of God today I receive your life I receive the abundance of grace and the gift of righteousness and I declare that I reign in life the power of sin the power of Satan the power of the flesh is broken over my life from today I move forward ever and backward never father we thank you for this once you have drawn to yourself I declare by the authority of scripture that your sins are forgiven and I declare in the name of Jesus that a new page is open for you you go forward ever and backward never I introduce you to the ministry of the Holy Spirit right now I declare by the power of the Holy Spirit that he will guide you he will hold your hands and turn you into signs and wonders you are blessed you remain blessed in Jesus name I pray amen and amen okay how do someone direct me okay all of you please in concert this way just follow the precious lady waving her hands and she would lead you there'll be a group of people to just meet with you briefly let's celebrate them as they go all of you thank you thank you thank you hallelujah hallelujah please rise with your offering I want to pray and bless your offering Hallelujah. Please help me with that. Okay. Thank you. Hallelujah. It is good to give in the house of God. Um, and it is not a ritual, it is with revelation. The Bible says, He that soweth sparingly, he shall reap sparingly. It says, everyone, even as he has purposed in his heart, so let him give cheerfully and not grudgingly. For God loves a cheerful giver. Then the next verse says, and God is able to make all grace abound towards you. So that ye having all sufficiency in all things. He says that you are bound to all good works. Lift your seed. In the name of Jesus, Father, we bring this because we love you. We bring this as proof that we honor you. 
we bring this because it's our it's our joy to see to it that your house is built and your purpose is established i speak over every seed that is lifted here and that which is coming electronically across the earth i bless it in the name of jesus in the name of jesus i give your seed a voice in the realm of the spirit i command it to gather its kind and return to you a thousandfold i declare from today and forever you are blessed you remain blessed in the name of jesus as you drop this seed pick up the next level of your finances in the name of jesus christ i pray amen and amen god bless you let me say this before i sit um you can you can go ahead and receive it south africa thank you so much i've been here a few days hold on i i want you to know that i love you thank you for what you do in my life and the ministry and um you can always get our teachings koinonia downloads.org they are all free you can get them and just build your spirit with them and um i want you to know that i enjoyed my time here i love south africa i love you from the depth of my heart hallelujah and and for apostle oko and the first lady i love you with all my heart i truly celebrate you i cherish you may god bless you south africa thank you If you have two hands, jam them together for Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, nobody could have done this except God. For God to allow him to come here in for such a time as this. So to God be the glory. How many of you will say that to me? To God. Dearly beloved, I hope you were blessed by this message. Do not keep the video to yourself. Share to as many as you can to help them bless. Check our homepage for more of our messages. Subscribe to the channel. Comment on it. Like it. See you on our next video. Bye. Pray. Pray. Pray for your destiny. Alaska de Basca Matata Branda Catecos, Cate Branda Catapa Cotosco for Precateca Lecata. The face of development, Lord, grant me the discipline.